The time has come. The final battle, Super Bowl 51. The Minnesota Vikings pitted against the Houston Texans to see who will take home the Lombardi Trophy. Minnesota knocked off the Eagles last week to advance to the Super Bowl, and the Houston Texans are making their first ever appearance after beating the New England Patriots. And so, Super Bowl 51. Let's go. This is what we've all been waiting for. The Super Bowl here in Miami as the Minnesota Vikings look for their second ever Super Bowl title after winning their first only four years ago. Adrian Peterson, Larry Fitzgerald, and Christian Ponder lead the way on offense as the Vikings look to knock off the Houston Texans as the Texans are looking for their first taste at Super Bowl glory. And here are the Minnesota Vikings, set to come out of the tunnel one more game. Can they get it done? It wasn't an easy road to make it this far. Three straight wins on the road, and now Minnesota just one game away from hoisting the trophy one more time. We are ready to kick off. Let's crown a champion. Here we go, Super Bowl 51 is officially underway as Sebastian Janikowski boots it deep and Blue out of the end zone will take it. Alfred Blue up across the 15 yard line, taken down at the 18. And Zach Mettenberger comes out, the product of Louisiana State University. 31 touchdowns, 8 interceptions, and had a big day two weeks ago in the AFC Conference Championship game with 298 yards. He'll throw on first and 10 out to his tight end, Pantale, for about 7 or 8 yards as we see the Texans offense come together. Andre Johnson, Tyron Carrier, and Arian Foster behind the quarterback, Zach Mettenberger. Second down and three, Mettenberger's quick pass outside is dropped by Mike Davis. Third down and three, now a handoff. Arian Foster up the middle, first down and more as he has a gain of 15 yards. Minnesota does have Jamel Fleming back for the Super Bowl. He'll be tasked with covering Andre Johnson as Mettenberger goes long for Pantail again, but he can't hang on. Second down and 10. Foster to Mettenberger's right. He takes a snap out of the shotgun. Clean pocket to throw. Plenty of time. Middle dropped. Third and ten coming up. Who will take control of momentum first? It's third down and ten. Mettenberger takes a snap. Fires to Andre Johnson. Catch. Good coverage by Jamel Fleming. Just a better play made by Johnson. Second down and five. Mettenberger drops back. He'll throw. Lobs outside of the screen and Foster will not make the catch. Johnson coming in motion again on third and five. Quick pressure, Mettenberger hit, and the ball sails incomplete. Fourth down. And now we'll see the Vikings offense for the first time today. Adrian Peterson wants ring number two, and Larry Fitzgerald wants his first. Peterson off the handoff on first and ten. Nowhere to go. Two receivers left for Christian Ponder. He takes the snap and fires over the middle. And there's Larry Fitzgerald for 15 yards and a first down. The Vikings, of course, four years ago, knocked off the Colts in the Superdome for their first ever Super Bowl title behind Super Bowl MVP Alfonso Smith's two late game interceptions. Third down and six for the Vikings. Three wide, right slot left, a pass caught by Kyle Rudolph, and he will not get the first down, just a yard shy. Texans football, four and a half to play in the first quarter. No score here from Super Bowl 51. Quick pass outside caught by Jones for six. Second down now, Vickers in front of Foster out of the eye formation. Mettenberger drops back to throw in the pocket. Time running out, he throws it deep. Looking for Carrier, he's got it. And he is inbounds, 45 yards. Huge mismatch. And here's one more look. Just a deep throw, Carrier beat TJ Stripling. And a big 45-yard gain now as the Texans set up in Vikings territory. From a 38-yard line, Mettenberger under pressure. He's in trouble, and he's sacked by Christian Ballard. Third and 18. The Vikings can put that 45-yard pass behind them. They can stop the Texans here on third and long. Pass outside by Mettenberger. Knocked away by Claiborne. Fourth down and long. Very stout rebound by the Vikings defense and now back in the hands of the offense. It's Adrian Peterson, but nowhere to go. J.J. Watt is in the way. Third down and nine. Three wide again for Ponder. Under pressure, J.J. Watt with the sack. And that'll put the Vikings down. Still no score. 50 seconds to play in the first quarter. Mettenberger pass outside. Screen to Foster. Breaks the tackle. Still on his feet. Seven yards of tough running. Texans bring out an extra tight end on third and three, but Mettenberger's going to throw. Wide open downfield. Andre Johnson got past Jamel Fleming's jam. First down, Houston. And you can see just the amount of separation Andre gets. That is incredible. 
Second down and six. I formation behind Mettenberger. Fakes the handoff to Foster. Fires to Chris Pantail. First down to the six. A gain of 13. Second and goal now from the 13 yard line after a penalty. And Foster nowhere to go. It'll be third and goal from 13 yards out. Vikings trying to make the Texans settle for a field goal here. They need 13 yards. Mettenberger, end zone for Mike Davis, touchdown! A diving catch made by Davis. He got separation, and here's one more look. You can see Sharice Wright just lost track of him, and Davis makes a wonderful grab, and that's the Super Bowl's first points, a Super Bowl moment for Mike Davis. Well, the Texans have answered first, and now can the Vikings put some points on the scoreboard. Peterson up the middle, big gain of about 18 yards, call it 17, first down Minnesota as Peterson's all excited. Peterson's largely the reason why Minnesota is here, and he may be asked to carry the load today as Ponder on first and ten scrambles out of the pocket. Doesn't like what he sees, but he picks up 20 with his legs into Texans territory. Great run by Ponder, good awareness, and now Peterson off the delayed draw, and J.J. Watt just so much destruction in the backfield. They need a game plan around J.J. Watt. He is a game changer. Second and 13. Peterson off the swing. He makes a man miss off the spin. Gain of eight yards. It's third and medium. From a 36-yard line. They're in field goal range. Vikings looking to get the first down, but Ponders passes off the mark. Looks like some miscommunication there with Sidney Rice. 53 yards out for Sebastian Janikowski. Snap on the left. Hash is down. Kick is up. It is good. The Vikings are on the scoreboard. 7-3. Texans still on top. Both teams have now scored 7-3 Houston as Mettenberger hands off to Arian Foster. He runs into two linebackers and someone appears to be hurt. Third down and seven. Taylor in Mettenberger's face, but he floats the screen for Foster who makes the catch, but is he short? It looked like he was going to have the first down, but DJ Green makes one heck of a play and he is indeed short. Vikings ball. Both defenses playing very tough football. 7-3 as Rice makes the first down catch for eight yards. Now second down and two, twin tight ends as a stretch play incoming for Peterson. First down up the left side for a few yards. Minnesota opting for a lot of twin tight end snaps as they are here again, but Ponder in trouble, he goes down. J.J. Watt still such a disturbing force. Second down and 18 thanks to J.J. Watt, and now the Vikings spread it out four wide. Ponder steps up and slings it for Fitzgerald, who makes the catch over the middle. After the catch, he gets the first down. Big play for Fitz as he gets in front of the linebacker, Brian Cushing, and does the rest with his legs. Big first down conversion. Two minutes ago in the first half, Vikings football and Ponder will throw, but he's in trouble again, and J.J. Watt, his third sack. Something needs to be done here. J.J. Watt is a problem. Third down and 13. Can Ponder dig him out of this hole? He fires over the middle. He's got Joe Webb. First down to the 23-yard line. 22 yards from the ex-quarterback turned receiver. And now third down and nine. Ponder. He fires over the middle. And Sidney Rice drops the pass on contact. And so the Vikings will kick a field goal. Sebastian Janikowski, 39 yards, kick is up, and it is good. The Vikings are now down by one, a low-scoring first half. Halfway done with Super Bowl 51, and the Vikings trail 7-6, a very low-scoring first half. Neither offense has taken control, but the Vikings in the second half have to account for J.J. Watt, and they have to get some bigger plays on offense, whether it be from the arm of Christian Ponder or from the legs of Adrian Peterson. Who wants it more? Super Bowl 51, the second half is up next. One half down and one to go. Super Bowl 51, the championship is on the line, and the Vikings will receive the second half kickoff. It's Christian Green from his own end zone. He feels the kick and up past the 20, taken down at the 23. It was a quiet first half, only 21 yards rushing on eight carries from Adrian Peterson. He gets the opening carry here on first and 10, and he starts the second half with four more yards. The Vikings are hoping that Adrian's 25 yards to this point are just the calm before the storm. On second down, Ponder finds Rudolph. Good for the first down, nine yards. Back to the twin tight end set. Stoneburner in, and Ponder evades J.J. Watt. Maneuvers out of the pocket and takes off. Slides ahead, first down, Ponder, a gain of 10. Once again, J.J. Watt almost had a sack, but the Vikings were able to counter it. Peterson out the middle, and he's got room to run about 12 yards. The Vikings having an impressive drive, and now first and 10, Gerhardt in the game. He goes up the middle, but runs into D'Amico Ryans and gets only one yard. 
Second down, Fitzgerald in motion and Ponder fires quickly over the middle and it's caught by Fitzgerald for a gain of five. It'll be third and four. Monty Ball in the game in the backfield. Sidney Rice's slot right. Ponder fires over the middle. One-handed catch for Larry Fitzgerald. The chains will move. Big catch, Larry Fitzgerald. Comes through big. He wants that ring and he wants it badly. First down, Vikings. After the big play by Larry Fitzgerald, how will the Vikings follow it up? Hand off, Peterson right side, trying to bounce it outside, but Aaron Curry is there. The Texans linebackers are doing an outstanding job in run defense. Now it's second down and eight. Ponder's quick throw is caught by Mark Harrison. Good for six, it's now third and two. And now Adrian, the lone setback, handoff. He's got the first down off the edge, tackled by Harrison Smith, first down Vikings. You can see Peterson starting to get it going. First and 10, Ponder fakes the handoff to Adrian, but he goes down, the sack is made by Aaron Curry in the backfield. From the 19, second and 17, it's a draw play for Peterson up the middle, but great job as Peterson only gets about three or four. But wait a minute here, J.J. Watt now on the ground in pain. He tried to make the tackle on Adrian, and he got his knee caught, and this does not look good for Watt. That could be a very huge blow to the Texans' defense if Watt cannot return to this game. Third down and 15 for Ponder, and he's sacked anyway. Cornelius Sanders, a loss of six. The Vikings looking for their first lead of the Super Bowl. Sebastian Janikowski, his kick is good, and he accounts for all nine of the Vikings' points today, 9-7 to seven Minnesota. The Texans for the first time today playing from behind 9-7 in favor of the Vikings as Mettenberger fires outside and Andre Johnson let the one slip through his fingers. Third down and inches, handoff to Foster and he breaks the tackle. Does he get the first down though? Jared Allen made the tackle. This is going to be close and he just got it. First down Houston. Second down and four, Mettenberger out of the shotgun. He hands off in the draw to Foster. Breaks the tackle, breaks two, up the middle on top of the shield. First down, Texans. Just outside of Vikings territory. Play action, Mettenberger, and he finds a very tight window to Hershey. That's good for eight. Third and two, Vickers in front of Foster. I formation, he leads the way, and Foster cuts back to the inside. Breaks a tackle, inside the 30, taken down to the 28-yard line. And we're gonna head to the fourth quarter. One quarter away, who will be crowned as Super Bowl champions? Not a lot of scoring, but both teams fighting. They want this championship badly. Mettenberger hands off to Foster, and he's wrapped up by TJ Stripling. Lost a three on that last carry by Foster, and now Mettenberger swings it out to Arian, and it's a fumble! It was a backwards pass, and the Vikings have it! Chad Greenway recovers! If this fumble stands, it is Vikings football! One look here, here's the throw, very good look here, it does indeed look to go backwards at least by a little bit. This could be a huge turn of events. Vikings football after the backwards pass by Mettenberger, recovered by Chad Greenway, and now Adrian Peters looking to get it going. Eight yards, call it nine on this carry. The Vikings want to take time off the clock. They're running the football handoff. Adrian, that's good for the first down. Chains move. Second and 12. Under eight minutes to play in the Super Bowl. Ponder fires outside on the throw, and it's cut by Fitzgerald. Good for 11 yards. It'll be third and one. Here's a big play. Marshall Musel leads the way, and Adrian Peterson does not get the first down. The Texans did not allow the fumble to turn into points for the Vikings. They have it now, six and a half to play. Mettenberger play action from his own end zone. He finds Chris Pantale downfield, 19 yards first down. No threat of a safety now, but it's third down and nine. Mettenberger, pressure off the edge, just past the Jones. It falls incomplete in the Vikings hole again. Still nine to seven. The Vikings have the lead, only two points. 5.06 to play. Ponder hands off to Adrian, makes a man miss in the backfield. He gets a block from Potter. Now across midfield. Adrian inside the 30, 20, 10, 5. Touchdown, Adrian Peterson, 70 yards to the house as the Vikings extend their lead. And here's a look one more time. Two defenders miss in the backfield. He gets a huge block from Nate Potter and then turns on the Jets and the rest is history. Adrian Peterson, all day. He's been doing this all career. And now the Vikings just have to hold on to this lead. 16 to 7, Minnesota up by 9, it's officially a two score game, under 5 minutes to play, but watch out for Arian Foster up the middle, he runs ahead for a gain of 20. Close to 4 minutes to play, the Vikings want to see that time come off faster, 2nd and 10 for Mettenberger, he lobs it outside, caught by Mike Davis on the sideline. 1st and 10 again, Carrier and Davis to the left, 
And Mettenberger will throw, but he's sacked! Eric Norwood comes around for a seven yard loss. The Vikings defense has played great football all day. Second down and 17 for Zach Mettenberger. He fires and finds Tyron Carrier. He escapes Jamal Fleming, gets 16 and a half yards. Now it's third down and inches. Out of the gun, it's Mettenberger. He fires outside and Carrier makes a fantastic catch against Jamal Fleming, first down Texans. And now they'll hurry it up. Clock running inside of 3.10 to play. Mettenberger out of the shotgun. He loads up and goes to the end zone. Andre Johnson makes the catch, but was he in bounds? Referee comes over. Touchdown. What a catch by Andre Johnson. Touchdown, Texans. We're back to a two-point game. What a Super Bowl this has been. Vikings 16, Texans 14. Vikings trying to hold on and put away the Texans. Three minutes to play. Hand off Adrian. Left side, he gets about four yards. Tackled by D'Amico Ryans. Now two and a half minutes to play. Ponder will throw, and he's under pressure, and he's dropped for a sack. Bailey makes the tackle. It's third and 12. You have to question the Vikings passing in that situation. It's now third and 12. Pressure off the edge. Ponder rolls out, finds Harrison, and first down Vikings. He converted, he made it. Mark Harrison, Ponder rolls out, throws a prayer to Harrison, and he got the first down. What a play by Ponder and Mark Harrison, and now Adrian Peterson up the middle. That's good for four. The Texans will use a timeout. One first down away from clinching the Super Bowl. Hand off Adrian Peterson. Off tackle. Powering his way. First down Minnesota. They have done it. First down. Adrian Peterson has just sealed the Vikings victory. And now they can take a knee. Christian Ponder ends the game. The Vikings. Two time Super Bowl champions. They win the final battle of the 2016 season. Super Bowl 51 belongs to the Minnesota Vikings. What a game. And it was Adrian Peterson late helping carry the Vikings to another Super Bowl victory. And I thank you guys for watching. It's been an incredible run here with the Minnesota Vikings franchise. And it has officially now come to a close. Season 6 is over. I apologize that it's taken this long to finish Season 6. But at least now, it has come to a conclusion. And we will end the series with a Vikings Super Bowl victory. With Super Bowl MVP, Adrian Peterson helped lead the way. Thank you guys so much for your continued support, although I've drugged the series this last season as long as I have. I don't want to do that in the future, but I have really just enjoyed this series so much. It has been my absolute favorite thing to post on my channel. I've posted over 100 individual games, and you've seen me grow as a commentator in the time I've done this series. And I still remember, I feel like this series really took off in week one of season two, which ended up being a Super Bowl winning season, when the Vikings won with a walk-off safety in overtime over the Giants. But thank you guys so much. You were a big reason why this series was so enjoyable for me, and I'm definitely going to miss it. Thank you for watching the Minnesota Vikings franchise.